against us with zero health given, so do not wear it. But of course, if you want to walk around Prodigy for style, you could. Um, it just seems to be a hat. How's it going, everyone? One Doctor G is here, and welcome back to another Prodigy video. So recently in my previous video, you guys saw that I told you guys about Summerfest and that it has dropped into Prodigy. Along with Summerfest, something else also dropped. And that something else was this season's Ultimate Membership Box. Now for the Ultimate Membership Box, it seems like Prodigy has done something different. They've changed the season. They've done something about the season which means it takes way longer because previously it used to be every month you'd get something. Now we just got something. So. Well, of course, what we are going to do is we're going to open this, but first let's read the information about it. So, the box says, Ramp up your Prodigy adventures with these ultra-rare and fantastic member-only items from this season's Ultimate Membership Box. Check back next season for more exciting items. And that seems to be what Prodigy has given to us. So it seems to be a recolored version of the porcupine, pompicle, whatever you call it, and the hat, which looks like they kind of cut part of a slipper and taped it to an half broken eggshell and painted it blue <coughs> <coughs> to be honest that is what it looks like and over here it seems like we got ourselves a tropical prom pickle along with a palm tree cap some interesting things we've gotten indeed now let's check the information about this prickle palm prickle we've gotten ourselves a tropical palm prickle seems to have 437 health at level 1. Not only that, but it's quite evident that it's an plant type pet and evolves at level 24. It evolves? Does it evolve into tropical whatever you call it? Like, how could we get, like... This means we lose the ability to keep this pet. It changes into something else. Interesting. Interesting. And let's look at its status. Its status seems to be like 60 to 40 percent, meaning this pet will deal decent, will deal okay damage, and its health is also not too bad. Okay, so let me tell you some information about the prom pickle while we do some battles with it. More like we'll spot it die while we do battle. Oh, that sounded a lot more brutal than I thought. So let's just put this guy up friends quickly. And let's go into battle, see if it's exactly like a prom pickle. Ooh, a water deke, how lucky we are. We can attack this guy with an earth type pet and see if it's any good. Now over here I'm expecting 600 damage, maybe 800, but nothing too insane. Okay, so it seems like we managed to do approximately 300 damage, or a little less than I anticipated. And not only that, but our character died, so we can switch over to something else. Let's. Oh yes, yeah, so it is a tropical palm prickle. Now at max health, now at level 100, the health which this pet has is approximately, well, is exactly 900, 9,836 health points, and its base health, well, evidently is uh, 437. Now this is an ultimate member only pet and it's very similar to the Palm Prickle. Now the Palm Prickle actually, interestingly enough, has the exact same has the exact same stats. Well it does make sense why these stats are exactly the same. Now its description says the leaf-like spines on the palm prickle's back may seem harmless, but they're actually very sharp. I feel like this person is speaking from experience. So its in-game description says the spikes on tropical prop pickles back pick up the fr pick up fruits and flowers as it finds itself tasty treats in the forest. Interesting. So basically, this guy's back acts as. Okay. On top of that, it also seems like that the prop pickle can cast two electric. No, it can cast two earth type spells, one electric spell and one fire spell. It, the two earth spells which it can cast are. Overgrowth and Force Hurricane, which is not too bad if you guys ask me. Like, you know, those spells are okay if you guys ask me. And then it can cast a one-person electric spell, which is known as... Interesting, it seems like that the monster might have variating spells for whenever it levels up. Intriguing, let's just take a look at the pets quickly. The best ways to see the spells of the pet is by using it in battle, so we'll see what type of spells our pet seems to be able to cast. Alright, it seems to be able to cast an electric- it seems to be able to cast dual electric, while on the other hand, some people have noted that it can cast dual fire as well. 
so it really depends on your Propical and how lucky you are. And now for those of you wondering, it evolves into a Tropical Spindle, which as you guys can tell, is basically a ripoff of the Spindle, but Earth flavor. Like you guys get what I mean, I didn't mean to say like Earth flavor, but you get what I meant, right? Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna take it as a yes. Anyways, Homie over here has the exact same health as the previous monster, the Spindle, which seems to be at 9,836, meaning they all get the same amount of, well, stuff while leveling up. Now obviously this evolves at level 25 from a tropical, prompical, though it's a tropical spindle as the name suggests. And of course it can cast two earth spells which will be the same, and then it can cast either a fire or earth spell or a fire or electric spell or fire or electric spell or fire or electric spell. Basically, the spells which this dude can cast variates between 2 electric or 2 fire or something along those lines. I do not know, it depends on your luck to be honest. Uh, fun fact, if you look at the tug of um, yeah, so that does seem to be all the information we have on our new pet which is dropped into Prodigy. It's quite interesting, this guy. Now let's take a look at that cap. What is the cap's name? Now as I saw, Prodigy actually did make a little... Actually, changed the season's length for every membership box which they use, which is quite interesting. But the other item which we got was the palm tree cap. Yes, it seems to be made of a palm tree and is a cap. Let's go equip it and see what it is. Oh yeah, as you guys can see over here, the cap, and let's go and read its description quickly. A fancy hat for those bright blue sunny days. Is that a tree growing on top? Don't be surprised if a monkey jumps on your head. You know, a monkey jumping on your head would actually be quite terrifying if you guys ask me. Would absolutely be terrifying. But it seems like this hat is completely useless with zero health given, so do not wear it. But of course, if you want to walk around Prodigy for style, you could. I mean, it just seems to be a hat. No, nothing better, nothing worse about it. Interesting. I mean, the last membership box item which we got, the Dragon Mask, had a hard bonus of 6, but this is giving us absolutely nothing. Alright guys, so uh, yeah, we covered everything which has been given to us in this new membership box update, so I hope you guys found this video informational, helpful, and well enjoyed it, and if you did, please do make sure to demolish that subscribe button and turn on that notification bell, and give this video a humongous thumbs up if you guys haven't already. Thank you to everyone for doing that, and bye!